everybody. It's time for the Christmas pilgrimage to Miami to see my parents. We've got a whole sack of gifts back here to pack up. We're getting ready. I'm not exactly sure what we're gonna do besides see family and maybe some Christmas stuff, but I'm gonna bring you along for just, just a quick little holiday trip to my hometown of Miami, Florida. So let's go. Feeling like Santa Claus here with sacks of gifts and we're gonna hop in the sleigh and instead of reindeer, we got horsepower. We're on the road. Quick service station stop. but it'll do. It's nice to have some sort of gummies to chew on when you're driving. We have like two more hours left. Got the big guitar, got hard rock over there. Still got about 45 minutes. We were supposed to have already been there like an hour ago, but traffic keeps trafficking. But now it looks like maybe 45 minutes to where first place that we're going to stop. That makes it a lot easier compared to a lot of other spots. <laughs> we made it. We are here at Bayside Marketplace in Miami. We're gonna go look at the water, we're gonna have dinner, and we're gonna enjoy this fun touristy spot. Here we go, let's go downstairs. Alrighty, let's go take a look at the water because that's what it's all about. This isn't where I pop my yacht. <laughs> As many of you know, I am from Miami. I grew up here and I've been to Bayside Marketplace many times through the years. It's an outdoor shopping, dining, and entertainment district, but the key feature here is that it's Bayside. It is on the bay. You can see the yachts and the cruise ships in the water. It is beautiful. So the first thing I want to do is go straight to the water. Oh yeah. You can see like, I love to see the, when the bridges lift up. There also just happens to be a Miami Heat game going on today. So we see a lot of people in their Miami Heat uh, like yeah. jerseys and tank tops and I've stuff. I've a few Orlando Magic games. Oh, so, cool. You know, nice. I'm an Orlando fan. <laughs> and one thing that's new here since last time I was here is this wheel, the Miami wheel. That uh, was not here when I was here last. All right, we're gonna try to get a nice view of the water as we're just right at sunset. I'm 
So one of the cool things here is to come by the water and watch the cruise ships take off and just look out over the view of the bay. It's so beautiful, right? Very. Yeah. It makes me long to be on a cruise ship on the open water, but just being by the water, yeah. it's a close second. It's really nice. So we were actually supposed to be here about an hour and a half before the time that we're here. But you know, it took a little longer, but we're still here thankfully before sunset to get these pastel, milky, beautiful views. But even at night, this is gorgeous. Like the city all lit up. What do you think about going on that wheel? I'm, I'm down. Let's do it. Okay. The wheel here is called Skyview Miami. Sky Views of America. And there's a QR code here, so we're gonna scan it and buy our tickets in advance. And we're gonna hop on this wheel and just watch the sun set into the dusky evening over the bay. Oh my goodness. The ticket booth is one of the little gondolas, very cute. And they have a, an ornament here, nice. Yeah, you're right. Thank you. And it's decorated for Christmas. That's cute. Here we go. All right, this is, I'm expecting nothing less than that as our view. There's the rules. We're going right here. All right. Oh my gosh. Are you excited, Sam? I'm excited. You know me, I love a high tool wheel. Oh. Thank you. Okay, here we go. Oh boy. <laughs> Woo! Excited to see the views from up here. Very pretty. Oh, off we go. They must go the other way. Yeah, the cruise ships go out. Here we got downtown, the city on one side. Oh, there's a Virgin Terminal there. Look. Sell the Virgin Way. We got to do one of those one day. Yeah, Virgin Voyages. That's like South Beach over there, right? Yes, there is like South Beach. So we're basically at the top. My hand is probably shaking oh, right now with they the camera. On the wall, yeah. Oh, wow, look at that. They just advertise anywhere nowadays, don't they? Oh, beautiful, amazing views, honestly. Yeah, yeah. Oh. Sunset ah. behind like downtown looks so nice. <laughs> I like how you're trying to distract me so that I don't get scared. Yes. I, I do really appreciate that. Okay, we I just get, were up on the top. I get excited like like when I'm out here and I'm like, I want to see everything. It's definitely like swaying. Yeah. But that's normal, right? Yeah. That's part of the design. But it is stunning. It is stunningly beautiful up here. These views are... I, I see a Christmas tree. Oh, oh yeah, down there. Okay, so we're going to look at the Christmas decorations after. And uh, we're gonna have dinner. Do you see that like fiery stuff going on down there? Where they're doing construction? Yeah, I saw that when we were past. Yeah. Oh my gosh. <laughs> it is cool though. It is very cool. Wow. Yeah, it's definitely getting busier at night. There's the guitar over a hard rock cafe here. Wow, the sunset's happening fast, huh? Yeah. We're going up to the top again, Sam. Here we go. Yeah, the glow's going from behind. Yeah, super cool though, my goodness. That is stunning. There are AC vents in here, so if it feels warm, remember to open those up. Where are you going? Small what fishing. you got in your boat? Small fishing maybe? Look at all the boats going out. Yeah. Like a ton of them. Oh, like a tall one. Like there are tour boats, there are like fishing charters you can do from here. You can go out and feed the tarpon. There's a ton of different boat related activities. Okay. Woo! I'm, I'm learning the lay of the land for when, when Grandpa Thought is Six is out. So I know exactly <laughs> where to go. You know? You'll be ready? Yeah. Cool, cool, cool. We just completed our third rotation. Third rotation, okay. Let's see how many more we get. Not yet, sirs. We want a couple more. I think we'll get five. I'm gonna get five. I think five, usually, I think like yeah, usually get about five, I'd say. It is really speedy. Some of the other wheels we've been on have been a lot slower than this. This one, they're like, 
This is Miami. Yeah. Let's go. Let's go. Woo, woo, woo. So look, you can check out the causeways over the water. People going to the beach. Nice. When you look at that cruise ship, even though that's kind of a small cruise ship, mm. when you see the little like normal ships next to it, yeah. it looks so big. Yeah. Yeah, see right out there is the Freedom Tower. And it looks like they're doing some construction on it. Look at how fiery the sunset is. Wow. The light is like blocking it, so I can't get it, but there's a car. Oh, I couldn't get it. It looked like a race car. Right, this light, doggone it. <laughs> no. Again? Again. No, please. I'm good, no more. I, I reckon we're gonna do eight. Okay. Oh, there's a car. Oh, I can't seem to get it on camera. If you got a boat car like that, you definitely want to drive past the places with a Yeah, you want to show off. You, you want off. you want to be seen. It's like an amphicar, car, but like looks like a race car. Looks like a Fast and Furious 2 car. Yeah, it does. I can't it's a, it's gone. Vroom vroom. There's no lights on it. That road dog. Yeah, weird. Look at the Christmas tree down there. Oh look at the Christmas decorations. Thank you. Ooh. Ooh. This is how I picture Miami. Hola Santa. You wanna go in the I Love Miami shop? No, I wanna go to GameStop. Okay. <laughs> I'll meet you after. Okay. You want your touristy stuff? No shortage of shops. Cute. <laughs> Tiki bar. You can just get, you know, touristy stuff, of course. And frogs. Just frogs. Anything good in there? Everything. <laughs> There's a lot of little shops and bakeries and restaurants, and I love the decorations. I don't know what any of these things are. What's that? Pastelitos y tequeños y empanadas. Looks good. It is good. Well, this is really pretty. Let's take a walk through the decorations. They have a Christmas tree and a menorah. Love that. Decorations everywhere. This is a light up carousel. It's not a real carousel, it's just for decoration. But look, it's macarons. Right? Or like candies? It looks like macarons. It looks like macarons, isn't macaroons. it? Macaroons. Macaroons. And there's things you can walk through and everybody's enjoying them and taking photos. Very nice. Across the street here, it says, Cuba under the stars, an immersive Cuban experience. And see this, it's made to look like the streets of like Havana. My family's from Cuba. So I'm three quarters Cuban actually. Mom full Cuban, dad half. So. Three quarters. Well, that seems neat. Let's walk under these lights here. <laughs> oh, so festive, right? Very pretty. Mm -hmm. Wow. Wow. There's a drone. There's people having like a photo shoot in front of the tree and there's a drone there too. I do not know what is going on, but it is very Miami. <laughs> Fun! <laughs> Let me free! Oh my gosh, does Bowser have you trapped? Oh dear. It's like sort of Pikachu. Yeah. Oh yeah, Bowser. Yeah, disturbing Pikachu. There are some storefronts that have walls up like construction or whatever going on and this one has some history of Miami's waterfront prior to the development of the Bayfront Park in the early 1920s. That's cool. Ships laden with building materials for Greater Miami's red hot real estate boom. I think they mean real estate boom. Miami's harbor in the 1920s. That's cool. I love that. Okay, I think we're gonna head to closer to our hotel area. We're still gonna get dinner, check into the room, and get settled in. We gotta pay for parking. Okay, and here we're crossing the beautiful Biscayne Boulevard. 
a lot of iconic stops along the way. We're gonna head to our hotel, which is a little closer to kind of family visits. So we got the Miami Heat game tonight and there's a ton of Miami Heat fans over here getting ready to go and enjoy a game. That's a ton of people. Roll the window down. No b-ball. Oh yeah. We're gonna have some b-ball game tonight. Ready for the space jam? <laughs> Shoot some hoops. I, well, hope they, I hope Miami get all the hoops. I was just about to say I hope they win tonight. There's a lot of uh, construction so the roads are a little off but no worries we're gonna make a right at this next at first avenue up ahead more more people going to the heat game turn right onto north let's go first heat avenue. that's what they say where i grew up uh -huh. in our town uh -huh. they have one tall building <laughs> there are a lot of tall buildings here but even more so than like when i was a kid it's the development in miami is it's astronomical we still have one tall building <laughs> it's not even that tall in a quarter mile, turn left onto the ramp to I-395 West. Wow, pretty. Yeah, very pretty. Lanes don't really matter, eh? <laughs> no, they don't. Whichever one you can get in. Uh, nice work if you can get it. Preferably one. Two. Preferably. Uh, if you can get two lanes, yeah. grab two lanes. Don't make it. Whoa, a lot of construction going on. Turn left onto the ramp Whoa. to I-395 West, then use the right lane to merge onto I-395 West. Okay. Here we go, here we go. Oh! Big town. Traffic town. Somewhere. I also wanted to add about the wheel that it was very pricey. There was like a deal, uh, certain days you can get it for cheaper and, and buying it online and stuff, but it was like almost $50 for 15 minutes. So I don't okay. know. Yeah, for both of us, not each. I don't know if I'd do it again, but it was, in the moment, it was nice. The moment as we were swinging through the air, very nice. <laughs> it was very nice. And it's cool to get those views, you know? Not a lot of places that you can get those views from that like you could just go and do it if you don't live in a condo or know someone or something like that. I'm hungry. All right, I totally missed that, but it said drive safely, be a good elf on that, on that blue thing up there. Trust me, it said it. Twenty-six South Palmetto oh. Expressway. So we got Tropical Park here, where they used to have Santa's Enchanted Forest, and now it's a new thing called Christmas Wonderland. Definitely, I can already tell it's not as many lights as Santa's Enchanted Forest because all these trees would have been lit up. But. It does still look Keep pretty right cool. Keep right at the fork to continue on Florida 826 South. It looks like quite a lot. Yeah, so that's like this whole promenade goes down and then it goes into the sort of continue on carnival Florida amusement park. South Ooh, monkey maze! It, it does look big. Two Ferris wheels. Oh, cute. Good spot. It's time for some Thai food. Oh, yes. Ask. I do like green curry. You do like it, don't you? I'm gonna get Pad Hun Sen, my favorite.
second was a breeze. This is a hotel that we like to stay in here. If you watched, I don't remember if it was last year or the year before, but there was one year where we came here and we stayed in another hotel and it was a travesty and we came here and they saved the day and it's been one of our favorites ever since and it's very, ever since, and it's very central and it's close to like the places we wanna go and the people we wanna see, so cool. And since it is connected to Dadeland Mall, we're just gonna go have a quick little stroll through the mall to like walk off dinner and see if there's any cute Christmas stuff. So let's go have an after dinner Miami Dadeland Mall walk. So from the hotel, you can go right into the mall. You have to go through Macy's, but we'll just hustle through that and have a quick walk through the mall. This is like nostalgia central for me because I used to come to this mall. Thank you. Please eat it. I saw about how like Toys R Us has like merged with Macy's or something. In movies, in American malls, you always see them like meeting Santa. Yeah. This is like a real, that exists. <laughs> this is it. Well, people, during the day, but do people yeah. still meet Santa in malls? I think so, I did. Did you? Yeah. I now did Now I meet him at Disney, but you know. Ah. <laughs> it's like a movie. Yeah. Oh, look at this. This is where you go in. See, this makes it more impressive. You go in through here and you meet Santa around there. feeling but you know malls are very similar all over the country but definitely Miami malls have their own flair <laughs> got a big day tomorrow going to do a little early Christmas celebrations with some family so we are gonna get some sleep and I will see you in the morning good morning we have a lovely parking lot view but that's okay because this was just a pit stop All right, we're in the car and we're gonna go visit my parents and have a little holiday celebration. So uh, it's a beautiful day in Miami. We got the Metro Mover, Metro moving. 
That's right, Miami has a little monorail of its very own. So off we go. Together today before we get back. So my parents grow a lot of things, flowers and, and plants and things. And this is a current very, very doing well banana tree. Look at all those bananas. That looks amazing. Absolutely beautiful day out. and head back home. driving back and forth from Orlando to Miami for years, my whole life basically, it always ends up being more like four and a half hours, maybe more. If you're lucky, maybe closer to four, but it's usually about four and a half. So if you're driving to Miami or from, plan accordingly. <laughs> but we got back, very smooth sailing, beautiful weather. It was just a couple days to go have like a Christmas with my parents, some family time and you know do the do the Christmas thing it reminds me how grateful I am to live here in Florida I've lived in Florida my whole life raised in Miami and now here in Orlando I I love Florida I love being able to wear t-shirts year-round the blue sky the sunshine we do have a little bit longer of a Miami trip planned in the next uh, couple of months so we'll be doing more stuff like that, but this time, yeah, just a couple days, and I'm glad we were able to go by the bay and do the wheel, that's cool, that's something new. And of course, see family. Thank you for coming with us. You know, I just wanted to vlog it for memories and to share it and just share a piece of my life that is different and, you know, just part of my story, I guess. It is very, very close to Christmas. What, like a week, less than a week, something like that? So, I don't know what's next, but there will always be fun and different things here and a variety of things. So thanks for sticking with me. Happy holidays. I'm sure I'll have another video or two out before Christmas. So we'll save the sappy stuff. Thanks for hanging out with us. I will see you for the next video. And until then, as always, stay enthused. Bye.